How many photographs do you think you need? I mean, you need your one as your sort of actor headshot, don't you? Because it makes you look professional. And probably, probably in that session with the photographer, you're going to end up with, say, three or four that you pull out. Because it's not like the old days where you had to print the photograph, so it was kind of in your hand. Because these days, photographs are delivered online, aren't they? So how many photographs do you need? Well, I think, see, the thing is about a digital age and the humble iPhone, the photos you take on a humble iPhone are fantastic, a great resolution. I think you need lots because it's a digital age, because that's the way you communicate to me. Because you tell me, if I'm a casting group that casts projects like The Killing, or The Wire, or, or True Detective, it's a different kind of photo you'd be sending to me than if you were trying to get into um, House of Cards, Sex in the City, Home and Away, kind of daytime TV. They're different photos, aren't they? They're different mediums, they're different genres. And it's a different form of communication that you need with that casting director. And if I don't know you, if, I, if you don't have a body of work that is known to me, then that is what I'm judging you on, your photo. Think about photos as a piece of communications in a digital world. That's, that's the opportunities that actors are being given now. But you've got to think about it and act on it.